this so, is what sorry, I Sorry, I'm do. having um, some Delma some work. Is. I'm having some work done around my place here, and they were being loud. And I got some dogs, but they uh, those dogs, <laughs> they're they're not really dogs, Jeffrey. They're wolves, and uh, and and so, but I can't oh, tell wow. I can't tell people that because it's illegal to have wolves. Welcome to the Sales Wolves Podcast. My name is Joseph Caldwell, and here is my co-host, uh, Tyler Harris. And we are the Sales Wolves. Uh, Today, we have literally been in meetings. I started my day at four this morning, and Tyler probably started his sh there or shortly thereafter. And uh, we had our first meeting meetings at seven and we literally just walked out of that into this one. And so we wanted to make today a little bit more fun, a little bit more entertaining. And so we are going to see how good of a salesman Jeff Mag is. <laughs> <laughs> and so we're gonna call him and I, he sells Medicare uh, supplements and, and Medicare Advantage over the telephone. And so we're going to call him and see if he can sell one of us. Although we're not going to be calling as one of us, we're going to be calling as a, as a slightly ripened, um, seasoned, seasoned, um, woman or man? <sighs> woman? Well, <laughs> can you want me to do a man or you want me to get it? I don't know. Uh, I got to really disguise my voice because yeah. I've known this man for 20 years almost. Um, what do you think? So what do you think? Woman? Probably a woman. Well, I got to be old. That sounds like Bill Clinton had sex with Maybe an old woman, which probably happened. But uh, what do you think? Booby. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff, my name Booby Johnson. <laughs> Dude, he'll pick up on that. Um, Let's see. What do you think? I go with a girl. You go with a girl? Yep. Yeah, what's her name? Thelma? Shirley. No, Shirley's the one that told me about you, Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. You think he'll pick up on it? We'll see. I don't think he will. All right. We're calling about Medicare Advantage, Medicare Supplements. I was referred to him by Shirley, and I'm Thelma. Deal? Mm hmm. Okay. Yeah. See if he Caveat. Caveat. Uh oh. Oh no. This is fair. This is the Sales Wolves podcast. And so we're going to see how many times he can say the word wolf. <laughs> <laughs> this is The goal be ugly. is 10. 10. That's a lot of wolves. All right. Wolf, wolf Jeffrey. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll keep count. Okay. We got it. <clears throat> Hi, thank you for calling. You've reached the voicemail of Jeff Mag. Please leave a message after the tone, and I will call you back as soon as possible. Thanks again for calling. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Uh, Mr. Jeffrey Mag, this is uh, Thelma, and my, I got a friend of mine down in Grundy that told me to give you a call um, and said you could help me with my Medicare. Um, I don't understand these parts and everything it says, so, so can you please call me back? Um, okay, thank you. On this one, on the feeling voicemail, say that your website clearly states that you care for seniors. You're, you're having a hard time understanding how they can put something like that in there. <laughs> Jeff Mag? It is. This is um, 
This is Thelma. I left you messages. Did you get them? Uh, who is this again? It's Thelma. Shirley told me to give you a call from Grundy. Man, I did not get your messages. When did you call me? But I, this morning and this afternoon. Uh, maybe I dialed the oh, wrong you number. Did. Oh. oh, I'm sorry. Man, I did not get any messages. I apologize for that. No, so I, you, she, um, Shirley told me that you would be the best man to help me with my Medicare. I sure, I sure would be happy to do that, without a doubt. Um, so, in fact, um, now, um, your, your first, tell me your name again, It's, it's Thelma. Thelma, okay, yeah, good. Okay, Thelma, what I'll do is, um, so you've been on Medicare, right? You've been on Medicare for a while? Yes, but I don't, I don't ever understand these damn things. They send me all the time in the mail. <laughs> well, you're not unlike most other people because it's really a confusing thing if you don't have anybody explaining it to you. Wolf, yeah, um, yeah. And I'll make sure we, I'll make, I'll make sure, I'll make sure we do that, Thelma, okay? Thank you, and, Jeffrey. Um, Shirley said fact, you were good like that. You would do it. I definitely will, yeah, for sure. Do you live in Greenville? I, I, I know I just have a Greenville number. I used to live in Greenville years and years ago. I've had this number probably 20 oh, uh, years. Oh, wow. Uh, do you live in Grundy then? I actually live in another place in, in West Virginia. It's just, um, it's, it's not too far from where they have that college. I got you. Okay. The, um, the, um, you, you actually live in West Virginia though. I do live in West Virginia right now. Okay. What I can do, Whoa. this is, this is what I will, this so, is what sorry, I do, I'm having um, some, Delma some work, is, I'm having some work done around my place here and they were being loud and I got some dogs, but they, uh, those dogs, <laughs> they're, they're not real dogs, Jeffrey, they're wolves. And, uh, and, and so, but I can't oh, tell, wow. pe I can't tell people that cause it's illegal to have wolves and they, sometimes they carry diseases and, but not mine. I mean, mine are good dogs. Man. I love wolves. Yeah, man, they're great. I love those. Um, well, Thelma, this is what I'll do. Um, do you mind if I get back to you on Monday? Um, oh. The only reason I'm saying that is because I'm, I'm driving to an appointment now, and I've got two more appointments after that, and I will call you Monday to um, discuss and go through that. Um, if that's okay with you. Yeah, yeah. So Monday, okay? yeah. Monday, you could call. What time do you think you could call me back, Jeffrey? Um, I think, um, let me see. I believe. Hey, you, you, you said you, I, you love wolves. Cause I, I could send you a picture of my wolves. Yeah, definitely do that. Send me a text at the same number. Um, send me a text and I will, uh, you know what, both of your text, both of your messages came through just now. Oh, I got that's both good. of your messages just now. So, um, let me, do it. Where do you, where, do you like a white wolf or do you like a brown wolf better? Cause I have two of them and I can send a picture of one Man. or both or. Send, yeah, send me both of them. I, my, my son would love that, too. He loves wolves. And, uh, yeah, send me both of them, and I'll show my son as well. I've got a, uh, um, in fact, what I'll do is call you. Um, do you have a lot going on Monday? The reason I ask that is I've got to leave in the morning and go up by the Charlotte area, but I'll be back um, probably by 2 o'clock, 2.30 in the afternoon, Monday, yeah, Jeff, and I would call Jeffrey, you after I just that. like to, 
I, I, th Monday afternoon at two would be good. I just, by three o'clock, I like to dip into, uh, dip into a little bourbon. <laughs> That's good. Well, I, um, I'll tell you what I will do. How about Tuesday morning? Because I'm not sure I can get to you by two. I, I may be in this appointment longer. And that's the reason I want to make sure that we've got time when I can. How about if I call you um, on, how about if I call you, hang on, Thelma, just one second. Um, let's see, how about, um, how about if, how about if I call you around uh, 2 o'clock on Tuesday? In in the morning, okay? Jeffrey. You said morning. I can't. I will be sleeping at two in the morning. No, no, two in the afternoon. Oh, two in the afternoon. yeah, yeah. Two in the yeah. afternoon works. Okay, okay. Call Selma. Uh, okay, good. All right, I've got you down, and um, I will call you then. Okay, Selma. Okay. And uh, but I'm glad I'm glad you uh, glad you called and it's good good hearing from you and I hope you uh, I, I hope you have a good uh, good weekend. Okay. Okay, I'll send you a picture of my two sales wolves. Yeah. Yes, I want you to do that. I really I love wolves. I like dogs and wolves and animals. My son does too, so he'll love to get a picture of those. Yeah, send them. Just okay. text them over to me. That'd be great. Okay, I'll do. Okay? I'll do that now. Okay. Thank you. All right. Thank you, Jeff. Have a good. Day. Have a good day. Bye bye. You too. Bye. Bye bye. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> what is the all nicest right, human? All right, on the I just busted this thing out of here and get this look back up. You know what? All right, we don't need anymore. We need to send him a picture of you and I and say, "Here's yeah. a picture of our. Here's a picture from my two wolves." Well, we can send it from Caitlin's number and say, that, "Hey, this is Thelma. I'm sending you a text from my husband's phone. This is a picture. <laughs> I promise, here, a picture say, of I me promise you a picture of those wolves, and then and then wait." And then we'll send the picture after. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Here, come here. You got to get the picture right here with this yeah. above our heads. You got to come get right there. Mm. <laughs> oh, here we go. There. Did you understand what Jeff did there? Like, let's talk through what he did. Yeah. He immediately started using my name, mm -hmm. right? Because what's the sweetest sound on this earth to anybody? It is the sound of their own name. Yep. It is the sound of their own name. So he had no idea we were doing this, obviously. <laughs> um, and then he immediately had me say what my name was again mm -hmm. to make sure he had it right. Yep. And, uh, and then he looked for a connection. And what was the connection? He loves dogs and animals and mm -hmm. wolves. And he wanted to, his son loves them he and all this. Where from. He asked where I was from. And, uh, um, and, but he didn't follow through on all the way through where I was from because I said a college near, because I mm -hmm. forgot the towns in West Virginia. Yeah. I was like, oh, yeah. what, are, what are some towns? So, did he text back? So he probably called me mm -hmm. if he's not in an appointment. I mean, so <laughs> he, uh, he also, <clears throat> with the appointment, um, he nailed it down. Yeah. Like, and when, when I said I like to dip into bourbon at three o'clock, he knew that he may not he get to it by three. And so he pushed it to the next day. And uh, so, which he knew he could do it by then. Mm -hmm. And now I am an appointment in his calendar. So, which is huge because he was on the road, which is, that's impressive. And dangerous. Yeah. Yeah. That <laughs> but, too. Um, but man, that's really, really good. Like, you know. Mm. And he probably has a bunch. There's. I already knew going in that he had a Miss Shirley <laughs> that he deals. He deals with a lot. And uh, and so I knew that he would think that that was Shirley from from Grundy or wherever. He has a bunch of clients in different states, and I think that's one of their names there. So. That's awesome. Anyway, what did you pick up on? That, I mean, he was just un, unfaded. Oh, yeah. Is that the word? Faded? No. Or phased. Phased or faded? 
Yeah. Or I just got a lisp all of a sudden. Yeah. He was unfazed. Like he was just like, oh, that's that's awesome. That's awesome. And you know that goes into mindset because he expects to get referrals and he expects sales mm -hmm. to call him. Yeah. Right. He just rolled right into it, yeah. laughing and going, "Yep, this is what always happens." <laughs> I mean, <laughs> if you didn't pick up, he said, "Two sales wolves." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's driving it. Oh man. Oh, it's good. That's so funny. This was almost as good as our last prank call to Jeff when it was regarding my dog that we were giving away at the time, having to be having to be put fictitiously down. euthanized. Was that? Did we do a sales wolf one? Yeah, that? remember? It was like at the end of one. Yeah, but did we pub, like yeah. put it out? What did people say about that? I, I didn't even see. Not sure. That means that you, you people aren't watching the end of our stuff because <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> oh, I had him going. Oh, yeah. That was incredible. Love that. What episode is this? 91? 91. It's 1991. Like it. All right, guys. So with that, this is episode 91 of the Sales Wolves podcast. Hope you enjoyed <laughs> that as much as we did. We just love fun stuff. Might as well. You Doing something make. different. You got to do it. Who looks like they've had more stressful life? Definitely me, by far. You look okay. like you've never had to face an issue. You've had a lot more time in the market. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Oh, my God. Oh. Who is more likely to have had impure thoughts about someone in this room? Definitely me. <laughs> <laughs> Tyler's such a handsome uh, man. Uh, yeah. <laughs> All right. With that, <laughs> this is episode 91 of the Sales Wolves podcast. I'm your host, Tyler Harris. Joseph Caldwell. And we are the Sales, sales Wolves. Wolves. Uh <laughs>